I'm a wiener! Yes! One of my many dreams has come true! Hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough! Now that we've explored the outside, let's go to the inside and see what's going on in here. Like say... A star piece right there? Yeah, I just thought I would get that before I forget about it. Move to one side, small fry. The only thing my camera shoots is famous athletes. So these are news reporter guys, basically. Yo, all the way, pal. I'll do stories on nobodies. Sorry, move it or lose it. Welcome to the Glitz Pit. There's a guy over there who gets paid to say that, right? Boy, it's hard to find a guy that's a clean cut and responsible these days. Probably because people who come here are typically from Rogueport. <laughs> hmm. All right, I seen you go over there. Don't don't you dare leave me. Welcome to the Glitz Pit. There, savage battles go on each and every day. Well, let's see if we can witness a uh, savage battle, shall we? Oh, looks like we are. Oh boy, these those two up there look pretty burly. Wow, this place is so cool. Hey Mario, look up there. There's a battle match going on right now. That's right. Uh, I think it's about time for you to feel the rock. Oh. Stay down, pincushion. You don't want more of this. Why do you even show up? Yeah, you heard me talking, Wimpy. Stay out of the ring or feel the burn, baby. Tell you what. Do about a million push-ups and then come see Uncle Rockhawk. Ah, so he's Rockhawk. I'll give you another world-class spanking and send you crying home to mommy again. Hooray, champ! That was a grade A whooping. Your thoughts on the match? You call that a match? Ain't there, <clears throat> ain't there a fighter out there who can challenge me? No, no one can. Hear me? Ain't a fighter out there that can even make me sweat. They're all a bunch of little crybabies running around in stinky diapers. You got a bone to pick? Come fight with me. Bring it on. I'll take on anyone. You weaklings might as well stick to video game fighting, okay? Because I'll hurt you. I think that that's exactly what I'll be doing here. <laughs> yeah! Number one, baby! Rockhawk is the champ! <laughs> what? Look at that! Um, you see that, Mario? That thing on the shiny belt, is that a crystal star? Sure looks like it. Yeah, yeah, it's gotta be. That sparkle's a crystal star. Um, but that doesn't make it much sense at all. Why would it be on that guy's belt? Hmm. Perhaps we'll find out. Boy, I don't know, Mario. It's not like, like we can just steal that guy's belt. Or can we? What should be our move here? Mm -hmm. Seal that thing! Um, listen Mario, I think the world of you, but really, we can't do that. <laughs> it just wouldn't be right. The way I see it, we have no choice. You gotta fight your way to the top and win that belt fair and square. Okay, I guess that's what we're doing. So I guess we better get started. There must be a novice sign up somewhere. My tummy's getting upset. Let's find the guy in charge before I lose my nerve. Okay, well, let's first talk to more people. Uh, I already talked to you. Uh-oh. 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 Why, oh, hello, Mr. Mustache. We meet again. I wonder what she is doing there. Hmm, let's go up to the second floor, shall we? Just, ah, uh, another reporter guy. I'm doing pretty good. Doing pretty good. Hmm, second floor, there's another set of, um, ways to view... See that? There's another fight going on there. You can also talk to people around here. Actually, I should, should uh... Oh, 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 really? Yeah, sure, why not? What? Oh, come on! <laughs> Don't get in the ring to avoid losing that. That does kind of make sense. <laughs> uh, what else? What do, you, what do you have to say if I say something else? Oh, no. It's one of these repeating sort of guys, isn't it? Oops. One, one more... Choice, whatever. Yep, he says the same thing either way. Okay. When I get a little older, I'm definitely going to be a pro fighter and make the loot. I'll be wearing that belt in five years max. I know it. Believe it. Okay, Naruto. You ever watch... Uh, you ever watch my elite fighters? I do. You sometimes find diamonds in that rough. 
Let me tell you, fans like fighters to grandstand them in. It drives us nuts! You'll find out what he means by that a little bit later, actually, when we actually start getting into this for realsies. Um, let's see here. Oh, there's that one lady off to the right that we have left to talk to last, so... Well, hello there, you big burly hunk of man, you. You're a smashing deer, but I'm afraid I'm only interested in the champion. Rockhawk, Toodaloo! Hey, that's my line. I, I say Toodaloo. What's that, Bob? You want to become a fighter? Hmm. Well, if you're serious, you better go meet with Mr. Grubba, the promoter. Mr. Grubba's office is just down the hallway. You can't miss it. Head on through. Okie dokie. Got anything else to say? Mm, not really. So, let's go meet Grubba. He sounds like a, a friendly guy. This is a minor league locker room, bub. Sorry, you can't go in there. Hmm. Sorry, fighters only, bub. No one else admitted. Dang. This is a minor... Dang. Everything's locked to me. There's a save block there if you want it. This is a champion's room. Only the champion may enter. Sorry, regulations. <laughs> Uh, uh oh. Lock door. Poopers. Man, what is open over here anyway? Um, actually, that's Grubba's office. I'm gonna just go back to this side and this, uh, speak with the people one by one. Actually, hold on. Uh, if you go out this door, you probably can guess where you're gonna end up. Yep, right here. Um, you are a repeat of the other guy. No. Oh. Do, I say, do. Uh, repeat. Ah, so much copy pasta. So much copy pasta. <laughs> I guess maybe they're trained to say that. All right, let's go meet up with Grubba. A guy named Grubba sure sounds like a trustworthy guy. What? Oh, and Tarnation are you, son? And who let you in? This is Grubba's office. Yeah, that's me, Grubba. And you the one who rude dude coming in without knocking? Hmm. What now? An athlete, huh? You want to be a fighter? Yeah, yep, 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 yep. Ooh-wee! I do change a thing or two, son. I always got time for an up-and-comer. Yep, this place is packed to the gills with young fighters, all primed and raring to go. I gotta say, son, you're a bit skinny for my taste, but I'm willing to give you a shot. Now, play me straight, son. You want to live the glamorous life of a champ, don't ya? Um, mm, 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 mm. I'll say that for fun. <laughs> All right, all right, son. I hear you're coming from, son. Loud and clear. Yeah, it doesn't really matter what you choose. In all honesty, it still goes on anyway. When I was just a poor pup, I didn't give a pokey's patoot for fancy big city ways. But I jumped into the world of martial arts and fought my way to fame and riches. So I guess he's quite the fighter himself. And know what I realized? Being rich and famous is diggity dang dynamite. And now I can't mix it up in the ring no more, but I earn enough to set me for life. You reading me here, son? Dreams do come true, even if they ain't yours exactly. Yep, that's the key, son. Dream big, and you'll get big. That's the winner's way. And when you make it big, you look back at all those small dreamers and laugh. You reading me here, son? I think Mario fell asleep again. <laughs> that's the spirit chief. Here, let us have a little walk and talk. Come on now. And thus he takes us for a semi-tour of the place, I guess you could say. This all kind of happens automatically, and I can't... Hopefully I'll be able to read it fast enough as he speaks it out loud. Or maybe he's not going to speak at the moment. Oh, well, never mind. Ooh, what is this fancy place? Isn't this the champion's room? Now, how do you like this, Pod? Just feast your eyes on this. Go on. This is the champion's room. Isn't it a sight? Deluxe! You become a champ, son, and you get the key to this room. That ain't all, of course. That's on top of the big money and screaming fans. Yeah, no doubt about it, son. Apply yourself and life of wealth and comfort awaits. Whoop. Now here's uh, uh, where we have the Major League locker room. A lot of contenders here. What you think, son? Hmm? Not exactly glamorous, but it's clean and comfortable. Indeed it is. Totally sanitary, too. Hey, that's the fighter that just lost in the ring, by the way, to the right, in case you don't realize that. But maybe I'm old-fashioned, but I care about my fighters, darn it. Now, I'm sure you know this already, son, but there ain't but one world champion. Clawing your way to the top and taking the belt to become champ ain't an easy thing. 
But that's the point, son. Wouldn't it be worth it if there were no challenge? That is true. I do like a good challenge. I can see you've got fire for it too, pod. You've got the eye of the tiger there. Yep, song reference. <laughs> You're going to be a champ. I can just feel it. I ain't never been so sure about a fighter. Oh, hey, one other thing. You gotta sign a itty bitty contract to be a fighter. It ain't no thing. Just take a second or two of your time. Just jot your name here, okay? I don't think so. What in the hey? You lose your taste for glory, son. Well, I can't say I understand your change of heart, but ain't nothing I can do. I like your style, though. So if you try to change your mind, just come back here, you okay? Okay, I've changed my mind. <laughs> Hey, it's a future champ. So you got your nerve back up, did you, son? All right, then. How about you just give me your autograph on this here contract? Okay, let's sign it without reading it. That sounds like a good idea. Hee! Best thing you ever done, son. Now, your Mario ain't a bad handle. Still got a save part. It lacks a little punch as a fighter's name. Get me? Let me see here. Bam! Hooey! I got it! From now on, you're gonna be the Great Gonzalez. Whew, ain't that a beaut? Dang, if that ain't a stroke of genius, a name that good comes around once a lifetime. Yep, anyone will soon bow before the Great Gonzalez. Make me proud, son. Dot, 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 dot. <laughs> well, now we got that out business side out of the way. Jolene, can you come in here for a minute, darling? Yes, sir, you wish to see me? Sure did, hon. Jolene, this is the great Gonzalez, our newest rising star. Be a peach and take him down to the minor league rock locker room already. Right away, sir. Mr. Gon <laughs> Mr. Gonzalez, <laughs> if you would please be so kind, if you would be so kind, please follow me. I lost all composure because the Gonzalez. <laughs> As you know, you are a contracted fighter now, so you must abide by some rules. First and foremost, when Mr. Grubba says go, period, you must do what he says. Also, as per your contract, you cannot quit until Mr. Grubba releases you. There are many other small guidelines that I will explain as they become relevant. Hmm, perhaps we should have read the contract. <laughs> um, well this certainly doesn't look like a major league locker room. Well, here we are. This is your locker room. You're starting in the minor league, of course, as you've just now started your career. If you don't like this dingy room, I suggest you work your way up through the ranks. Oh, I get it now. When you're ready to fight, just log on to this computer terminal Game Boy Advance. I mean, just con computer terminal here. Mr. Grubber will then decide who you'll match up against. You will have no say in this. Why don't you try it once? Walk up to the screen and log on with A. And pick reserve a match. Okie dokie. First I want to talk to the competitors. Take care of yourself, dog. Don't forget any rookie mistakes. Know what I mean? I do. I've been making them all throughout this walkthrough. <laughs> Alright, Mr. Bomberman. Grah, mustache that stuff, fighter. Yes, I am. There's a big block in the way of something. <laughs> I do believe I'll go out for my regular stroll soon. Alright, let's, let's reserve a match. Yeah, oh, let's see the rankings, actually. Let's see. Oh, come on. That's baloney. I want to see the rankings. Fine, I'll reserve a match. I'll look at the rankings later. Well, howdy, Gonzales. Ready to get your fist dirty, huh? There you go, son. I got a treat for you. Your first battle is going to be against the Goomba Brothers. Don't you worry about them. They'll be a piece of cake. Just mop them up, okay, son? Hey, we want to get everyone fired up though, so appeal to the crowd at least once. Pay attention to that, by the way. You'll get questions about detailed rules. Just ask lovely Miss Jolene, okay, son? Well, good luck, Pod. Thank you so much. Okay, your battle is reserved. At this point, you just wait until security comes for you. Fighting is pretty basic. A team that drops the opponent's HP to zero first wins. I know how to play this game. If you beat an opponent who ranks above you, your ranking will go up. And again, if you lose to a lower ranking opponent, your ranking will go down. Simply winning is not enough. When Mr. Grubba sets fight conditions, follow them. In this case, the condition to appeal to the crowd at least once. Fairly easy. Yeah, so you can't advance unless you actually follow Grubba's instructions. So I'm going to have to actually use um, odd stuff that I wouldn't typically use in battles. But that's what makes this area so much fun. Anyway, if you satisfy the condition and win, you can battle a higher ranked opponent next. If you can get your rank up to 11th, you'll get a shot at the Major League. That's about all you need to know for now. Yes, I got it. 
Okay, good. For now, just wait until security comes to get you, Mr. Gonzalez. Okie dokie, I'm gonna wait right by this door. <laughs> yeah, that's what happens if you're by the door and he comes. Gonzalez, match time. Follow me, bub. Okay, security's here to escort you to the ring. Try not to get completely destroyed out there. Okie dokie. And he just kind of went right through me. Alright, here we go. Rank 20 match. Oh! Excitement! Squaring off next, folks. Oh, the Hoppin' Hardheads, the Goomba Brothers. And a newcomer with a hankering for hammering, the Great Gonzalez. The Goomba Brothers have been waiting and getting all head up for the fight. Let's check in. How do you, how do Goomba Brothers, how y'all feeling today? You ready for this fight? Ha! Are you kidding, man? We're always ready to bonk or fool or two. Who is this Gonzalez rookie? A cocky idiot, that's who. Waiting just makes us mad. We're gonna teach this tardy punk how to respect fighters with seniority. I think maybe you ought to call an ambulance for now, just to save the time later. Ooh, them's fighting words. <laughs> Hot diggity dang, fight fans! That's the great Gonzalez. Now, striding on up. I tell you, this rookie's got some guts strolling up late like he owns a place. Whoo! Okay now, Gonzalez, listen up. Let me just explain the rules of the match real quick. Have a bong pong! Oh, jeez! So, yeah, the, some of the fighters don't... Ex oh, I was gonna say, don't exactly play fair, but that wasn't, uh... Um... <laughs> it didn't work out for them anyway, because I had that badge. Come on, Mario, if we can't let a bunch of cheaters beat us, let's take them down. Aw, oh, quit crying, will ya? That was just a welcome gift for the rookie. Where's our thank you? Alright, so let's do a little appeal right off the bat. Just to get that done and over with, because my plan here... Oh, wait, 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 what's an audience? Ooh, is that a good mushroom? Was that a good... What was that? I didn't recognize what that was. I don't remember an audience throwing something like that before. Did something happen to Koops? Did it make him lose his turn or something? I want that. Oh, yeah, it did kind of disable him. Okay. Anyway, the plan that I had is to, of course, multi-bounce these. Wow, I suck. <laughs> that's fine, that's fine. Mm -mm. It's not like they're gonna do any damage to me anyway. <laughs> I mean, they are old school, basic enemies at this point. What am I doing? Wait, wait, what's that? Okay, I'm gonna let that mushroom get thrown to me this time. Okay. What? Yeah, what does that do? I never. Rec I mean, I never really seen that before. It just seemed impervious. Unless it's because. Koops has one defense, and that's supposed to do damage? Oh, I was gonna do a power shell. Well! Guess I can't do that. <laughs> that's fine, that's fine. I wasn't really paying much attention to my flower points. I can always rest at the uh, Rookie League locker room, and I'm forgetting to do action commands again. Isn't that lovely? <laughs> Aww. That would've been nice to get... Uh, oh! I tried to do a super guard. I tried to be all fancy, but I failed. I can't be fancy. I'm too rusty for this. <laughs> oh, poor Koops. Has the properties of Koopa when jumped on, he gets flipped. Poor, poor Koops. And they're down. A great Gonzalez wins! Tell me, son, what was this first taste of victory life? Mm, eh. That was a joke! I'll tell you what I just saw, folks. A whooping. This kid's got skills. And Koops is all like, aw, shucks. <laughs> We got ourselves a new hero. Let's hear it for him, folks. Yeah, the great Gonzalez! Woo! Where's that confetti coming from, anyway? Is it coming from the spotlights? I, I, don't, I don't know. It's just kind of appearing in thin air. I should, probably shouldn't question the game logic. Well, Gonzalez, that fight wasn't a total loss. But listen, son, fighters got play to the crowd. You know, pop them up more. I was hoping you'd give me more razzle-dazzle next time, huh? We understand each other? Good, I'll be on my way. The Miss Jolene will here give you your fight money. See ya! I appealed to the crowd, what are you talking about? That was just fine. <laughs> and I get... Three coins. For that fight, really, three coins. That ugh, rip off. But at least my ranking was. Because <laughs> I did the fight properly, as Grubba said. Next fight you see will not be set until you select your match on the terminal. You can also check your current ranking on the terminal, current terminal screen. Feel free to do whatever you like until your next fight. Okie dokie. You have a nice day, Mr. Gonzalez. Thank you very much. The people are so friendly here, except maybe the fighters. 
Yo, Rock. How was your first fight, dog? Mm, went pretty well, went pretty well. I'm Key K, man. Just a Bush League scrub like you. Good meeting you, man. You look like a stand up dude. I think I can hang with you. Mm, okay. Hey, so uh, why don't you meet the gang here? This guy here is Master Crash. I thought you were Bomberman. Well, I, I guess you're Master Crash too, but I like Bomberman better in all honesty. Oh, never mind. <laughs> Yeah, he just, he just likes to add bomb to sentences wherever, I suppose. It's kind of like the characters from Animal Crossing, I guess you could say. Like when they add whatever phrase they have or whatever you gave them. <laughs> and, he, and he mentions it. That's not just sometimes. Bomb! Advice is always useful. Bomb, bomb! <laughs> That's how I envision it. Right, man, whatever. Anyway, this lean machine over here is Bandy Andy. <laughs> Bandy. Hey, nice to meet you. Not in here too often, but if you see me around, say hi. Okie dokie. Oh, yeah. If you sleep in the bed over there, your HP and fully, FP will fully recover. Yuppers. That's just as I explained in the fight. It's not like the cushy bed in the champ's room, though. It doesn't refill star power. Oh, poopers. Oh, cool. The last guy with the sweet purple kicks is known as Kleftor. Ah, Kleftor, no like. Make friend with mustache. So he's the Incredible Hulk. Easy there, cleft dog. Don't eat the friendliest guy, but you get used to him. <laughs> anyway, that's the core of minor league crew, man. You need to see something? Ask us. Oh yeah, I almost forgot. You and me gotta eventually square off, so good luck, man. Same to you. Now, let's reserve a match here. Actually, wait, let's view, view the ranking. Let's see who we are up against. Because, yeah, each of these fighters actually has uh, names here. And yeah, Rockhawk is in the champion spot, so I guess there's a, a first place ranking and then there's the champion spot, so there's a champion higher than first place, if that makes any sense whatsoever. <laughs> Alright, let's reserve a match. Well, boy, howdy, Gonzales. Fixing for a fight, huh? Oh, I should have recovered my flower points. Well, I still have time to do that, actually. And it's going to be the KP Koopas. Avoid using any of the special moves. No problem. I typically don't use them anyway because I like to conserve my star power in case I need it. Alright, so let's go... Oh. Hey, dog. Looks like your next batch against me. Well, that was quick. Good luck, man, to both of us. Uh, I should actually switch to um, Goombella because there's going to be a lot of new enemies in this place that's actually a... Uh, um, going to need a lot of tattling. And I mean, there's a lot of new enemies here, so... Alright, do not use special moves this match. Let's do it. Let's do it to it. Sonic Saturday, I'm something... Okay. <laughs> New version of Koopas right here. For our next battle, we got the Merciless Executioner, the Great Gonzalez, and the Shell Machines of Doom. Yep, a fox to finish with the KP Koopas. Come on, Mario. Let's get this over with. Indeed. Meet my peeps, Gonzalez. I told you we were going to square off, and now it's on. Get yourselves ready to battle. Woo. So this is... Uh, yeah, I, I, I know, I know. <laughs> I'm going to start off by tattling the one that's more likely to fall out of the sky, the KP Paratroopa. And... As you can tell, it's a slightly different one. Max HP is 4, attack is 2, and defense is 1. Its attacks are the same as your average garden variety Koopa Parachupa, so do the same thing as always. Stomp on it, flip it, and drop its defense to 0. My head is pretty effective against it too. Come on, let's get him! Uh, actually, I should probably get that right out of the sky immediately. Woo! And now I'm going to have to deal with... Yeah! That's what I thought. Mm. No effect on me. Well, it sort of had an effect. Now I'm going to... Stun them all! Oh, yeah, baby. I'm still forgetting to do the stylish moves out of habit of trying not to do stylish moves for the first portion of the walkthrough because I didn't want to get too complicated. But anyway, that's it's fine. I'll get the hang of them again. That's a KP Koopa. It's a Koopa Troopa of a slightly different color. Yeah, same stats, basically. Looks like its abilities are just like any Koopa, so he ought to be a piece of cake. Don't go easy just because you know King K, Mario. That's what friends are for. Yep. Give your opponents an honorable match. Alright. Normal jump for the win. And... Oh! Oh! Woo! 
That's way better than that poison mushroom I got the one time. <laughs> oh, poopers, I really flubbed that up. Both in the stylish timing and... Ah, oh, there we go. I knew I'd get that again eventually. Arr. <laughs> Woo! Sweet! We got ourselves a winner! The Great Gonzalez! What do you expect, huh? We rock! Each of the, the partners has a different uh, victory uh, phrase, I guess you could say. Here's your fight money, Mr. Gonzalez. Thank you very much. And four coins this time. All right! We are raking in the dough now. <laughs> I'm starting to get a, a southern accent. Because <laughs> I've been doing grava so much. Hey, way to hand out a beat down of, out there, man. You beat me, straight up. Could swing the other way next time, though. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, indeed it could. Um, um, I think I'll do one more match this part. I think that sounds like a good idea. Well, boy, howdy, Gonzalez. Fixing for a fight, huh? Well, alrighty then. Let me just see here. Your next opponent will be... Rank 17 in the Glitz Pit. The Pokey Triplets. Now listen, son. In this battle, I want you to avoid uh, more special moves again, really? Really? Still? Oh, okay. And... There they are. <laughs> Alright, let's do this. Rock on! Mm. Rock on like Rock Hawk! New enemy, Pokey! Let's tattle those suckers! For our next battle, we got the Merciless Executioner, the Great Gonzalez, and the Spock Terror Triplets. Yep, fight to the finish with the Pokey Triplets! We are gonna lose the scopes like you! <laughs> Go ahead, touch us. It won't hurt too much. Get yourselves ready to battle! I was born ready. Oh, whoa, whoa, one's got a life shroom. That's an interesting twist. Very interesting twist, in fact, because once it goes down, it's just gonna revive itself, and yeah. That's a pokey! It's a cactus school that's got nasty spines all over its body. Max HP is 4, attack is 3, and defense is 0. Look at those spines! Those would totally hurt. If you stop by it, you'll regret it. Pokies attack by lobbing parts of their bodies and by charging at you. They can even call friends in for help, so be quick about taking them out. Okie dokie. I think this is a good time to show off the earthquake then! One's gonna revive though, of course. <laughs> and it just recovers it. Oh, please don't su oops. Please don't summon any okay. Uh ooh. Kumbella's gonna have some trouble, isn't she? Wait, uh, doesn't hmm. Oh yeah. Because Mario's hammer isn't the thing that's upgraded. Yeah, and it's gonna leave you with two HP. Mm, I hope it doesn't Oh, I can't attack with Goombella unless I I can show this off too. <laughs> Why not? Yeah! Hey, I should just use that to start with because it does 5 HP of damage. Woo! Told you there were going to be a lot of new enemies to tattle in this area. We got ourselves a winner! The Great Gonzalez! And see, same victory phrase. I'm going to have to rotate characters just to show you the phrases that you can get there. Here's your fight money, Mr. Gonzalez. Thank you so very kindly. And I have rose to rank 17. Okie dokie. And with that, I think I'm going to end off the part here. I hope you enjoy. Oh, wait, maybe not. <laughs> hey, what's cracking, G-Man? You just finished beating down some poor fools or what? You're looking good, man. The old King K wouldn't mind a little bit of your luck, man. Yeah, that'd be nice. Getting there, are you? Uh-oh. How many times do I have to tell you? That room is absolutely off limits. If you want to remain on our fight roster, you must follow the rules. And don't think I haven't noticed you following me. Stop that too, it's creepy. <laughs> if you don't obey the rules, we'll ban you from the glitz pit. Understood? She sounds like a moderator of sorts. It looks like uh, he, he's been a, a sneaky Sam lately. Again, dude, man, you're just a magnet for trouble. <laughs> Sorry, King K. Didn't mean to be Queen Nag in here. Oh, don't sweat it, V-Money. Jolene could take that too and shove it up her nose. What? You're always chasing that girl anyway? You got a little thing for her? Shut up, Kay. Now, 
if you folks will pardon me, I must be off. And he's gone. Just like he says. So, okay, now I'm going to end off the part here after a quick save. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next part. Whoops, wrong direction. Here we are.